This episode of CleaningBiz.TV is made possible by Marketing Systems by Design, the only authorized duct tape marketing consulting company in the cleaning industry. I'm Jean Hansen, and this is a show that will help turn your vision into a successful cleaning business. A cleaning business owner recently wrote to us about his excitement with a flurry of activity happening in his business. Here's what he wrote. This week has been exciting. I had four appointments, submitted two proposals, and have two more appointments for next week. I'm getting excited about how things are starting to come along. It's been a slow four months, but now things are really taking off. I've seen so many people struggle with their business for the first few months and then decide to hang it up. It's pretty easy to do in this industry because it's fairly inexpensive to start a cleaning business. So if it fails, people think, oh well, I didn't have that much invested anyway. Now a certain percentage of these people never put much effort into it to begin with. But there are people who work hard marketing the business for months but see little return on their time investment. What some of these people never realize is they gave up right before the floodgates were about to open. What if they had stuck it out just a little longer? As you can see by the member I just mentioned, a wave of prospects came to him after a very slow four months. I've seen lots of examples like just like this one. It happened to us when we started our second cleaning company. We didn't know anyone at all in the town we moved to, so we had to start from scratch. Every week we attended networking events, just trying to meet people in the community. We finally got our first client after four months, and after six months, the floodgates finally opened. Within a year, we had momentum and a steady stream of prospects. And for those of you who have been in business for a while and find that incoming business seems to be drying up, take a look at your marketing. Did you get busy in your business and stop marketing? I've seen this happen too. Companies get busy and put marketing on the back burner. If you do this for months at a time, your steady stream of prospects will dry up, which is why it is so important to continue marketing your business on an ongoing basis. So for those of you considering giving up, rethink that notion if you know you've been putting in the effort to get your name out there through networking and marketing activities. Your success could be just around the corner. If you have a similar story, please share your comments by posting below the video at cleaningbiz.tv. That's it for today's show. If you're struggling with marketing and gaining a steady stream of clients, then sign up for the free ebook called Seven Steps to Small Business Marketing Success at marketingsystemsbydesign.com. I'm Jean Hansen, and you can find me on Facebook, LinkedIn, and Twitter. Just look for the links at cleaningbiz.tv. See you next time.